Hey you, I'm the hostess with the mostest, the guy with the BMI. My name is Thomas Tomscar Ridgewell. I'm Elliot Goff. And I'm Eddie Bowley. And welcome back to... Content. Content! I'm mixing things up. Sure. I've got a hat. I'm, 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 I'm improv I'm confused. My mental health is great. My sanity is great. Everything is good and fine. Dealing with this well, are you? Mm -hmm. Hey, boys, have you heard about the, the hip new website, WikiHow? Wiki what? <laughs> Wiki feet. I've got a page on that. What? I'm rocking a steady 3.92 out of 5, baby. So let's read some of the comments on my wiki feed. Love it. <laughs> the, specifically the bath pick. <laughs> Where's that even from? A bath. <laughs> There's a content. Trying to get my feet the top rated I can on WikiFeet. WikiHow is a website, I guess, designed to like share knowledge uh, and teach people how to do things. I don't know if it's like community run or something, but it is famous for having sort of like ridiculous accompanying images for its articles. I found a website that will generate a random, at least I think it's random, WikiHow image. And we have to guess what article that could possibly be from. Let's guess what this specific image is. <laughs> we got a Reddit wedding ring. Yeah, that's that's the con that's the thing that changes this. Is it's like there's a wedding ring. It's like it's the white void around it, so it looks like you're getting punched by God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> who I, who I assume is married. Our options are how to be the type of nerd that girls love, how to be confident as an overweight adult, uh, how to touch a girl. <laughs> Not this way, no. And how to trust a wife. Oh no, I don't like that one. Oh no, and he's married. None of these are great options. Yeah, so I'm gonna guess. Yeah, wife, I guess. I mean, I'm between t girl and wife. Okay, we're going with wife. Yeah, wife, wife I hate. Wife, we are right. And I don't like that we're right, but we are. <laughs> Oh! What have we got in this article? I mean, the first impressions is, is something biblical? Well, I was actually getting, he's, tr he's trying to use his mental energy to stop that snake from killing him. I <laughs> he's staying calm under a stressful situation. You've got the snake and the Jesus beard, so my brain is saying like, oh, something about temptation. Why is he bald? He doesn't deserve that. It's Jesus. He can do what he wants. He can turn wine into wine. He can get rid of his bald. Alternatively, it could literally just be a case of what to do when you're being attacked by a snake. Pretend it's not there. <laughs> I'm going for like a biblical resist temptation thing. Yeah, it's de I definitely think this is allegorical. Our options are how to get your nipples pierced. Yes, that one. Uh, how to improve your sexual stamina. That's not a snake, it's just dick. <laughs> <laughs> How to respond to fundamentalists. That's religion. And then how to play bridge. Well, I feel like if you're if there's a snake wrapped around you, you're playing bridge wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very right. We don't I don't know how to play bridge. One of the first things in the article is like, now a common misconception with bridge is that you don't have a giant snake wrapped around you while you play it. Leave the snake at home. I'm gonna go with how to respond to fundamentalists because it that seems that sounds religious. I am correct. I win, I'm the best, I am great. We're sorry, this article is currently in quality review. That that's fair. There's too many snakes. There's no snakes in fundamentalism. Everyone knows this. Ooh. Uh, oh. That is a, a mouth someone has drawn. Where's the lips? I is it a shark human being? Is it a hybrid shark man? Is that fucking Voldemort? Maybe he's like drawn his lips in. Like, it's like, like his lips are over his teeth or something. <laughs> but no, they're clearly not though, because you can see his teeth in the image. But that's like in the wrong image. You got the tick and the cross. So one's like correct and incorrect. I mean, uh, yeah. I wonder if it's like, it teach you how to whistle Ooh. or how to shut the fuck up <laughs> how to stop talking <laughs> how to stay in your fucking lane <laughs> if your mouth is open uh oh well i, li I like it though it's like yeah how to whistle first of all don't still have your mouth open because it'll just like <laughs> ah! oh my fucking ears all right so we're going to go we're going for whistling uh, are we i guess so yeah how to say some common phrases in esperanto how to take action if a guy calls you ugly. <laughs> Shut up. No, don't say anything. How to convince people at school that you're a vampire. Ooh. It's got to be that one. Don't show the teeth. Gives it a big giveaway. And how to play an alto saxophone. I mean, you do have to have your mouth closed. If you just go... <sighs> 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 I think I'm, I'm gonna lean more towards as funny as shutting the fuck up is. <laughs> I think I'm 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 going for vampire. I'm tempted to go vampire, but I'm be, I'm gonna be different and go with sax. Okay, well we can only go for one. So vampire, it is not. It's how to play the saxophone. Oh, Holy right. shit! What the 
fuck? What? What's happening there? Sit in chair. But he's not even sitting on it right. He's sitting in it wrong. This chair is not a sax. Don't blow this. What is happening? The image is gone. It's been replaced. It's been replaced probably with this one, I'm going to guess. So they've at least the image no longer exists. The world has been spared. Is this game made by Wiki How to correct their mistakes? Huh. Oh. Is that a bun? It looks like a wind-up key. Where's it going? What's happening? Okay, we've got how to be a spy, how to pull an all-nighter, how to cure a headache without medication, and how to support the arts. It's got to be the headache. Oh, you don't have any ibuprofen lying around? Well, I'm sure instead you have this weird, incredibly specific device. I must know what it is. It is, it is, yep. Try transcranial magnetic stimulation. It's a magnet. Oh, what? An alien is eating your brain. <laughs> oh! <laughs> How to control your friend. My guess is it's going to be some bullshit, like how to convince people you're a robot. I wonder if this is another allegorical thing of like, yeah, being overly controlling of people. His pose and face isn't on. No, you can't do that. I'm voting uh, it's something to do with pretending you're a robot. Mind, mind control in some way, like peer pressure slash mind control. How to explain Lent to a child. How to love. How to love. <laughs> How to become a teen hacker. You're hacking the teen. <laughs> How to make your boyfriend break up with you. Pretend you're a robot. Teen hacker, does this mean literally you're hacking teens? Because that's what's happening in this image. I'm going with teen hacker. I'm all in on teen hacker. Teen hacker it is. How to make your boyfriend break up with you. Teen hacker was great though. Try to control him. Yeah, it was about being manipulative. Start obsessing over everything he does. Tell him that he shouldn't wear those shoes with those pants. Just be abusive. This article is horrible. How to feel active during in quarantine. What's that arm doing? How to hail a taxi whilst bowling. His thumb's like this. His thumb's like all the way down. I'd imagine a lot of these are traced, but off goblins, I assume. But also they're celebrating, but he hasn't done anything yet. They just love, they fucking love it. I wonder if it's to do with like being a supportive partner, like, you know, be into the same things they are, you know, whether that's a good that's a good assumption, yeah. He he's he's into bowling, she's not, or vice versa, and it's like just get into the stuff that they are. Yeah, honestly, like I think Eddie's right. Yeah, I mean let's let's see what the options are. Let's see how close that is. How to pretend to be a wizard? Yes, a thousand percent that one. I will make this guy bowl. How to persuade a Christian to become an atheist? <laughs> <laughs> Look! No way! If God's real, <laughs> explain this, explain bowling, explain how that gets televised. It's boring as shit. Alternatively, how to be a Christian leader. And finally, and the one that I think confirms Eddie's theory, how to show your husband that you love him. Of course, the real answer is touch him on his penis. You know what? Not surprised. I'm not even going to check the article. No, we get it. Yeah, we got it. We know. We b we been new. Oh my Ooh. god. Oh. This is a party. First assumption is how to be the life of the party. Or how to get abducted. Whoa, aliens. Like these two are running away and this guy's like, alien, hi. Take me. He's he kiling the aliens. <laughs> oh no. How to avoid abduction with white nationalism. Thoughts? How to join Hitler in heaven. <gasps> <gasps> oh no, Eddie. <laughs> Fuck, okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Eddie's just revealed a lot about himself there. Uh, wow. <laughs> wow. You're not allowed in a church ever again. No, that's it, you're done. What are the choices? How to be the type of nerd that girls love. How to help save whales. How to ask a girl to dance. But more importantly, how to avoid uncomfortable conversations about religion. <laughs> such as, where did Hitler end up? I mean, dancing's an answer to most problems, to be honest. Yeah, you can avoid a lot of uncomfortable situations with dance. Tom, have you have you seen the you know a doctor about that lump yet? I'm going to assume you're dancing. Oh, I am dancing, yeah. What do you want me to do? Tell you I'm dancing? We uh, can't see you. That's the thing, I guess. <laughs> Shall we go with how to ask a girl a grill to dance? He's like dancing on his own first in the hopes of just eventually Get into her, maybe? <gasps> it's not! It was how to help save <laughs> whales! <laughs> Fuck off! Okay. What? Fuck off! We need off. to know. What? Host a community event, including a dance party. So that's where this uh, was from. Yeah. And now it's been replaced with sad people. Come on, everybody, do the whale dance. <laughs> 
Then they all pretend to be dead. You just lay on a beach and slowly die. Lay uh, on yes, the <laughs> dance craze. Lay down and gasp for air until you die. That's my favorite dance. Oh, Jesus, woman. Well, look at them chompers. They uh, are some teeth. <laughs> that, is, that is where the eye is drawn and will remain. I have to wish. I'm, my vote is that whatever it is, it's about teeth. Maybe it's like how to break the ice, how to talk to a date. Use your giant fucking teeth. <laughs> Eat the ice. Okay, we got how to be honest, which we know it's not. How to release endorphins. How to be an educated man. And how to act like royalty. Ooh. How to be an educated man. What if in this image he's like, oh, a fine year. Tastes of oak and my balls. That's what I'm kind of imagining. He knows about, know about wine. Did you know wine is a liquid? Oh, and that's my camera. Uh-oh. Oh, stinky. Are we gonna go with educated or royalty? Uh, I'm gonna go with educated. I feel like educated's kind of my best bet. I vote ro royalty. I'm gonna go educated as well. And I was right. I'm the best. Everyone else is garbage. So that was a fucking video. Here's our favorite fan art of the week. And here are the most recent videos. If you missed them, content comes out every Tuesdays. So if you come back on Tuesday, you'll be sure to find another content. Rest in peace, Eddie. RIP. Here I am, boys. I'm in heaven. Oh, look! Look who it is! <laughs> no! <laughs> who is it, Eddie? Not it's again! It's a whale! <laughs> ah! <laughs>